and to fill us in on the live and local music scene this weekend from the Record Exchange, it's Chad. You're not, you're not Chad. I'm not Chad. Who are you? My name's Elizabeth. I'm from Radio Boise. Oh, cool. Elizabeth, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thanks cool. for having me on the show. Hey, it's a pleasure. Tell us a little bit about Radio Boise. KRBX 89.9 FM Radio Boise is the very first community station in the Treasure Valley. Locally programmed, all live, all local, no, non-commercial. It's great. You can go to RadioBoise.org to check out our program schedule. Love it. Cool. Now can you fill us in on the uh, local music scene? I would love to. First of all, I'd like to remind everybody that every Thursday night through September in Meridian and Nampa, there's Meridian Urban Market and Nampa Downtown Nights that have local live music if you're interested. Nice. If you want to get out of town this weekend, up in McCall, the Summer Music Festival at Roseberry is Thursday through Saturday. Thursday night is Locals Night. Friday is Bonorama with Jeff Crosby, a local favorite. And Saturday is Keller Williams with Town Mountain. If you're coming back to the Treasure Valley, Friday night at the Eagle River Pavilion is Michael Franti with Spearhead. Nice. If you've got tickets for that show, make sure you get there on time because Steve Fulton's opening and he is a fantastic musician, huge local favorite here in the Treasure Valley. Very good. At the Linen Building Event Center in downtown Boise, Friday night starts off their Bring It to the Stage music competition. That's a four-part series starting this Friday at 7 p.m. Sounds awesome. In downtown Boise, if you really want to get down and funky, there's a Portland band called Manimal House coming to Tom Graney's, and that is both Friday and Saturday night. The cover's $3, and it starts at 9 p.m. I'm always looking to get down and get funky. Who isn't? Yeah, totally. Another weekend-long event, Pizza Stock 2 at Pizza Chick on State Street in Boise. That's starting 5 p.m. this Friday and running through Sunday night, and that's over 20 local bands. No cover charge all weekend. Fantastic. Awesome. If you're in the west end of the valley, out in Caldwell at the Bittner Vineyards on Saturday, Jonathan Warren and the Billy Goats are going to be playing. They're a real great time. That's an Americana kind of bluegrassy band. Super fun to dance to if you're out there just having a glass of wine. It's going to be a beautiful afternoon. And finally, to start off next week right, make sure you don't miss Uber Tuesdays at the Visual Arts Collective. Dirty Mittens from Portland is going to be in town, as well as Dark Swallows, Owl Wright, and Antlion. Those are three local Boise bands that I have absolutely love and the cool thing is that there's no cover charge pit brewing is there with micro brew specials and archie's place is there with a food truck so you could spend your whole beautiful tuesday night there well i gotta tell you uber tuesday sounds uber fun it's gonna be it's awesome elizabeth thank you so much for joining us and uh, we'll look forward to seeing you again in the future here thank you perfect stick around maury tv coming up next